The gridiron rumbles. Saints and Bucks clash. The Superdome was electric. The atmosphere was charged with excitement as fans from both sides filled the stadium, their cheers echoing through the air. The anticipation was palpable, and everyone knew they were in for a thrilling game. Fans were buzzing with anticipation. The energy in the stands was infectious, with fans donning their team colors, faces painted, and voices raised in unison. The camaraderie and rivalry between the fans added to the spectacle, making it a true celebration of football. It was a classic NFC South showdown. The stakes were high, and both teams were ready to leave it all on the field. The players lined up, eyes focused, muscles tense, ready to execute their game plans with precision and determination. The New Orleans Saints were set to host their rivals, the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. The Saints, with their rich history and passionate fan base, were determined to defend their home turf. Meanwhile, the Buccaneers, known for their explosive plays and strategic prowess, were ready to challenge the Saints' dominance. Both teams were hungry for a win. The energy was palpable. The players on the sidelines were focused, their faces etched with determination. The fans, waving signs and chanting, created a wall of sound that spurred their teams on. It promised to be a game to remember. The intensity of the game was evident from the first snap, with both teams executing plays with precision and skill. Every touchdown, every defensive stop, every yard gained was met with roars of approval or groans of disappointment from the crowd. The Saints, led by their veteran quarterback, were looking to make a statement. Their quarterback, with years of experience and a deep understanding of the game, was the linchpin of their strategy. His leadership and ability to read the defense were crucial to the Saints' game plan. They were looking to make a statement. The team had spent countless hours strategizing, analyzing their opponents, and perfecting their plays. They were ready to show the world that they were still a force to be reckoned with, capable of taking on any challenge. They wanted to prove they were still a force to be reckoned with. Every big play, every successful drive, was a testament to their hard work and dedication. The celebrations on the field were a reflection of their passion and commitment to the game. The Buccaneers, with their own star quarterback, aimed to assert their dominance in the division. Their quarterback, known for his arm strength and accuracy, was the key to their offensive strategy. His ability to make quick decisions and deliver precise passes made him a formidable opponent. They aimed to assert their dominance in the division. The Buccaneers' defense, known for its aggressive and relentless style, was ready to challenge the Saints at every turn. Their goal was clear, to disrupt the Saints' rhythm and capitalize on every opportunity. The stage was set for an epic battle. The tension in the air was thick as the teams faced off on the line of scrimmage. The panoramic view of the stadium captured the grandeur of the moment, with thousands of fans on the edge of their seats, eagerly awaiting the next play. This was more than just a game. It was a clash of titans, a battle for supremacy in the NFC South. First quarter early defensive struggle. The atmosphere was electric as fans filled the stadium, eagerly anticipating the clash between two formidable teams. The scoreboard displayed the first quarter, setting the stage for what would be a grueling battle. The Saints won the coin toss and elected to receive. This decision was met with cheers from their supporters, who hoped their team would set the tone early. The crowd roared as their offense took the field. The energy was palpable, with fans waving flags and chanting in unison, creating a sea of team colors. However, the Buccaneers' defense came out strong. They were determined to make a statement from the get-go, lining up with intensity and focus. They shut down the Saints' initial drive. Every tackle was met with cheers from the Buccaneers fans, who could sense their defense was in top form. Tampa Bay's defensive line was relentless. They broke through the offensive line with ease, applying constant pressure on the quarterback. They pressured the quarterback on every play. The Saints' quarterback found himself scrambling, trying to avoid the onslaught of defenders. The Buccaneers' offense had their own struggles. Despite their defense's strong performance, their offense couldn't capitalize, facing a tough Saints defense. The Saints defense was equally impressive. They matched the Buccaneers' intensity, making crucial stops and keeping the game in a deadlock. They forced a punt on Tampa Bay's first possession. The Saints defense celebrated as they jogged off the field, having successfully halted the Buccaneers' advance. The first quarter was a defensive battle. Both teams traded punts, each possession ending in a stalemate. The crowd watched in anticipation, knowing that one breakthrough could change the game's momentum. The score remained tied at 0-0. The tension was building. Coaches on both sidelines were deep in thought, strategizing their next moves. Players on the field were locked in, ready for the next play, knowing that the game was still wide open. As the first quarter came to a close, it was clear that this game would be a test of endurance and strategy. Both teams were evenly matched, and it would take a moment of brilliance or a critical mistake to tip the scales. Fans from both sides were on the edge of their seats, reacting to every play with gasps and cheers. The players' faces showed determination and focus, each one aware of the high stakes. The sun began to set over the stadium, casting a golden hue on the field. 
the stage was set for an epic showdown, with both teams ready to give their all in the quarters to come. With the first quarter behind them, both teams prepared for the next phase of the game. The early defensive struggle had set the tone, and now it was time to see who would rise to the occasion. Second quarter. Bucks strike first, Saints answer back. The tension in the stadium was palpable as the second quarter began. Fans from both sides were on the edge of their seats, anticipating the next big play. The second quarter started with a bang. The Buccaneers, known for their explosive offense, wasted no time in making their presence felt. The Buccaneers finally broke through the Saints' defense. Their offensive line created a perfect gap, allowing their running back to exploit the opening. Their running back found a hole and scampered into the end zone. It was a well-executed play that showcased the Buccaneers' offensive prowess. The crowd went silent. The Buccaneers took a 7-0 lead. Buccaneers fans erupted in celebration, while Saints fans were momentarily stunned. The Saints didn't panic. They responded with a methodical drive of their own. The team gathered in the huddle, determined to answer back. They marched down the field. Their running back picked up crucial yardage. Every play was meticulously planned and executed. Then, their quarterback connected with his tight end for a big game. The pass was precise, and the catch was flawless, moving them closer to the end zone. But the Buccaneers' defense held strong in the red zone. They were determined not to let the Saints score a touchdown. The Saints settled for a field goal. The score was 7-3. It was a small victory for the Saints, but they knew they had to keep pushing to overcome the Buccaneers' lead. The atmosphere in the stadium was electric. Fans from both sides were vocal, cheering their teams on with unwavering support. Coaches on both sides were deep in discussion, adjusting their strategies to outmaneuver the opposition. Players took the opportunity to hydrate and refocus. Replays of the Buccaneers' touchdown were shown on the big screen, highlighting the agility and speed of their running back. It was a moment that would be remembered by fans for a long time. Despite the setback, aimed hopeful. They waved their flags and chanted, showing, un chanted, showing unwavering support for their team. As the clock ticked down in the second quarter, both teams knew that every second counted. The battle on the field was intense, with neither side willing to give an inch. Players lined up for the next play, their faces showing intense focus and determination. The game was far from over, and both teams were ready to give it their all. The aerial view of the stadium captured the energy and excitement of the crowd. It was a thrilling game, and everyone knew that the best was yet to come. The football was placed, ready for the next snap. The anticipation was building, and fans were eager to see what would happen next. On the sidelines, players listened intently as coaches gave their final instructions. Every detail mattered, and the next few plays could determine the outcome of the game. Fans held their breath, waiting for the next play. The tension was palpable, and the excitement was at an all-time high. The quarterback took his position, ready to make a play. His eyes scanned the field, looking for any opportunity to advance. On the other side, defensive players prepared to block. Their focus was unwavering, and they were ready to stop any advance. The snap came, and players sprang into motion. The game was in full swing, and every move was crucial. Fans reacted to the play, their emotions swinging from excitement to tension. It was a roller coaster of a game, and everyone was on the edge of their seats. As the second quarter came to an end, the scoreboard showed the Buccaneers leading 7-3. It had been an action-packed quarter, and the stage was set for an exciting second half. Halftime tension momentum shifts after Saints' touchdown. The Buccaneers were driving again. They were threatening to score before halftime, but the Saints' defense had other plans. They came up with a huge turnover. Their star cornerback intercepted a pass. The crowd erupted in cheers. The Saints took over possession. They were energized by the turnover. They drove down the field quickly. Their quarterback threw a perfect strike to his wide receiver for a touchdown. The Saints took the lead 10-7 just before halftime. The momentum had shifted. Section 5, Third Quarter, Defensive Battle Intensifies The third quarter was a defensive slugfest. Both teams' defenses were playing lights out. There were several sacks and tackles for loss. The offenses struggled to gain any momentum. The crowd was on the edge of their seats. The Saints' defense continued to impress. They forced another turnover. This time, it was a fumble recovery. But the Buccaneers' defense also stood tall. They intercepted a pass of their own. The score remained 10-7 in favor of the Saints. The tension was palpable. Section 6. Fourth Quarter Fireworks – A Back-and-Forth Nail-Biter The fourth quarter was a nail-biter. The Buccaneers knew they needed to score. They started taking more risks on offense. Their quarterback threw some deep passes. One of them connected for a big game. The Buccaneers eventually punched it into the end zone. They tied the game at 10-10. The Superdome was rocking. Both teams traded punts. The clock was ticking down. The tension was unbearable. Section 7. Interception seals the deal. Saints snatch victory. 
The Saints got the ball back with just over a minute left. They needed a miracle. Their quarterback dropped back to pass. He was looking for his star receiver. But the Buccaneers defender read his eyes. He jumped in front of the pass and intercepted the ball. The crowd went wild. The Saints had done it. They had pulled off an incredible victory. Section 8. Celebration in the Big Easy, Saints triumphant return. The final whistle blew. The Saints had won. The crowd erupted in celebration. The players hugged each other on the field. It was a hard-fought victory. They had earned it. The city of New Orleans was going to party all night long. The Saints had given them something to cheer about. It was a reminder of the special bond between the team and its fans. Section 9. The Bigger Picture. Impact on standings and playoff hopes. This win had huge implications for the Saints. It kept their playoff hopes alive. They were still in the hunt for the NFC South title. The Buccaneers, on the other hand, were left to regroup. They needed to bounce back from this tough loss. The game also had an impact on the overall NFC playoff picture. The Saints' win shook things up. It made the race for the playoffs even more exciting. Section 10 Until Next Time The Rivalry Continues The Saints and Buccaneers had given fans a game to remember. It was a classic rivalry game. It was full of drama, excitement, and passion. Both teams left it all on the field. This game was just one chapter in the long and storied rivalry between the Saints and Buccaneers. Fans can't wait for the next chapter to unfold. It's sure to be another instant classic.